Titans on the road, 12 and a half points, uh, underdogs against the Kansas City Chiefs. Got a text from uh, a buddy called Snoop. <laughs> Snoopy, the dog. Um, Tennessee. He said, we got to take Tennessee this week. I said, we'll talk about it. I don't know what to do. Like, I would hear more from people why they love Tennessee. Uh, when I first saw this number, I like Tennessee, the fact that it's a huge number for the Chiefs at home. Historically, they let teams hang in this. I mean, I can even – off the top of my head, I can think of Jordan Love's game with Green Bay. Like, that game, Jordan Love might have completed five passes. They somehow covered the 11-half spread, wherever it was that Green Bay was. Uh, I don't know what to do. Like, the Chiefs historically don't perform well as big favorites. Um, There's usually a spot you go the other way. So, the fact that a pro texts me mid-show uh, that we need to talk about Tennessee – you know, makes me know where the pros are at. Uh, I'm not going to be surprised here in the sharp calls. A lot of pros are going to be on Tennessee. I don't know. Don't feel comfortable doing it. So maybe that's even more reason of doing it because Malik just could not move the ball in Houston. Houston's defense is much worse than this Chiefs defense is. And this is Arrowhead, right? So it's a lot to put on a rookie QB. Um, maybe it's just the fact that it's Derrick Henry. King Henry right now is looking like the best running back in football doing it all. Maybe Christian McCaffrey. I shouldn't say that. Uh, Man, that's a tough one, Chad. What are you thinking with this one? Are we going Tennessee here? I think I saw, I, I looked at this this morning and thinking about today's events and was like, yeah, I think we're going to bet the Titans. <laughs> yeah. Again, it just feels like a situational play and a huge number. You've seen Vrabel get his team up for these kind of games. Like yeah. the defense just plays for him in these spots. So we could have pie in our face, me and Chad, and we're down 28 nothing, and there's zero chance that Tennessee could come back in a game like that. But we're hoping for is a 13 to 10 half at half or something like that. Just a game that's sloppy and Tennessee can keep close. And that's the game that they're going to try to play. So big number. Already got pros texting me about it during our live show. It's probably a smart move. So I'll just shut up and uh, agree with Chad and take that number. 